back to my channel. My name is Morgan and I'm obsessed with all things beauty and skincare related. And in today's video, I'm going to be doing a side-by-side -side comparison of the La Mer Creme de La Mer, their original, versus the La Prairie Night Cream right here. You guys have been requesting that I do this video, so it's finally here. Let's get it popping. Guys, also before I continue, I would really appreciate it if you could subscribe to my channel. I see a lot of people watch my videos, but they're not subscribers. So it would mean a lot to me if you could subscribe, support my channel, I'd really appreciate that. Also share my videos with your friends that can really help my channel grow and we could reach a whole new world of people that we can introduce our love to luxury skincare to because I think the community just needs more of this. I mean, at least we do. I love luxury skincare. La Mer is my favorite skincare brand. It's been since forever. Nobody has ever really been able to dethrone it. But I know it's really helpful for people to see like side-by-side -side comparisons of these products. Now, La Prairie is right up there with La Mer. It's actually potentially more expensive than La Mer. Like they have a lot more really expensive lines. Like there is the original La Mer formula, the Miracle Broth, and then there's the Genesance Day La Mer crystallized version of the Miracle Broth. So those are like the two different lines that La Mer carries where La Prairie has like their caviar line, their ice crystal line, and now they have their gold line reinterpreted and back up for sale. So La Prairie just has a lot more to offer when it comes to different lines. However, both are very, very, very good quality skincare products. Products. I know that because I like I could just tell a good product that sits on my skin at this point I could pass the expensive taste test like like times 10 sorry don't mean to brag but like it's true okay so what I like to do in these videos is I go one side La Mer one side La Prairie I'm gonna show you both of their textures before I begin I'm gonna give you guys a really up close and personal look that way you guys can decide which one you want to buy because ultimately it's totally up to you what skincare brands you want to invest in first that you think will work for your skin some luxury skincare brands that work for me may not work for you however I think never mind I'm just gonna I'm gonna keep it going so we're gonna take the original Creme de la Mer. You guys, if you're new, first of all, this is like a deluxe sample size. I've been through so many jars of Creme de la Mer that I can't even count. So just trust me on that. Trust me on that. Trust me on that. I've been doing samples because of course I try other luxury skincare that I'm really trying to like give a go. But the moisturizing cream has been around. It's like the original la Mer, the, they say it's the original La Mer cream. However, some of you had recently brought to light that the moisturizing soft cream is the original La Mer formula. So I think that's gonna be something that I definitely need to look into to really get that full result for you guys. But now La Mer is known for its hydration, its healing properties, it's made with sea kelp, and really the most important thing that's in all La Mer products is the Miracle Broth. So that's what you're really paying for which no one knows exactly how they formulate it. So no, there is no dupes. So I'm gonna just open this up and you can see the texture of this cream right in here. It's very thick, it's white, it is definitely just a unique cream. Wow, this is, so just, just as a reference, this is a lot for one side of my face. This, this amount will actually cover my whole face and neck sparingly. So I might actually have to use a little less. Sorry guys, but literally the thing that I love, love, love about the Creme de la Mer and all of my products is a little just goes the longest way and it makes for such an affordable product at the end of the day, cost per wear. So I'm gonna put this formula right here. This is their original creme right here. And I do wanna just show you the La Mer night cream. So guys, this is their anti-aging night cream. This is being phased out of the La Prairie lineup. They're in favor of uh, giving us more expensive skincare products. They're seeking a specific clientele. Do I agree with that? No, it's not really about the money for me. It's about what works best for my skin, but I'm just letting you guys know what's really going on. So they're phasing this out. I believe this is around $255. That's affordable for the La Prairie brand, period. Their skincare products are like like five, six hundred dollars and up. They're very expensive. This is originated in Switzerland and it has a whole heritage. It's just the creme of the crop when it comes to skincare, just like La Mer. 
if not more expensive. But again, I don't go by price, I go by uh, how they work. Oh. The packaging is a lot different. It's it's heavy, it's it's luxurious, just like La Mer. It's, uh, this is in all silver, and it's just giving us all the La Prairie vibes. Here is the interior. Yes, I am almost done with it, so I definitely feel comfortable doing a review with you guys. So uh, before it's empty, I actually have to do a comparison video because I won't be able to purchase this product again. So here are the textures. So this is La Prairie, this is La Mer. The La Mer formula is definitely more stiff. It's definitely very thick. It's, it's definitely thicker than the La Prairie. However, that doesn't make it less hydrating. It just makes applying it just a little different. So the La Mer product, you, the La Mer formula, you definitely need to uh, rub in between your fingers and press it into your skin, and that will really activate the product and get the Miracle Broth flowing. Whereas this, you could apply the La Prairie Night Cream, you could apply just like another cream. The texture of it is very smooth. It's very, very easy to move across your skin. It's easier to to use, period. The La, the La Mer definitely is a little more involved in application and it is a little harder to apply. So if you don't like those extra steps in a skincare routine, like you may not like the original Creme de La Mer, just saying. Now, I do use both of these products for a night cream. Uh, this, the La Prairie, you can only use at night. It's You could use it in the day, but it's called their night cream for a reason, where the La, the La Mer products you can use morning and night. You could even use these products around your eyes. The La Mer, again, cost per wear, cost per use, I still think is more affordable than La Prairie and a lot of other brands that are even less expensive than a jar of La Mer just because of the way the product applies and works and the longevity of it. So I'm gonna take the La Mer. Obviously, it's different in color, texture, everything, just totally different concepts. So I'm gonna just take the La Mer. It's, oh my gosh, I just, I am waiting. Guys, can I just say something? I am waiting for La Mer to just come out with a body mist that smells like the original Creme de La Mer. Like, please give us that, La Mer. I know La Prairie has a body mist that I actually just smelled for the first time over the weekend that I, I absolutely want. I'm gonna put it right here. It's a body mist that energizes your skin, like you, that you could apply it right to your skin out of the shower. It smells like a spa and it has like energizing properties. So you're really like moisturizing and like energizing your whole body rather than just your face. And I really, really wish La Mer would come out with something like that, just FYI. So with this La Mer cream, you put it in between your fingertips and you gently rub your fingertips together to activate it. I always like to show this on camera. This is not activated. You could still see a cast of white. Therefore, it's not totally activated. You really wanna make sure your hands are translucent. Again, this does not, this is not how you apply La Prairie. This is only a La Mer thing. So you just warm it up. I personally embrace this step because I am just, I love it. I, I love a very involved skincare routine. So I'm just gonna go a little more. I put a lot on, like I'm gonna get a lot out of this. So, okay, so we're completely translucent now. No, I did not rub the product in totally where it's not even, um, like a lot of people think because you rub it in between your fingertips, you're wasting the product and you're absorbing it into your skin. That's not how La Mer works. Trust me, you will have a lot of product to use on your skin. So all you do with La Mer is you just pat. I, this is the original cream, but you honestly take your time patting. Don't pat it like this. I've seen people do that. No, take your whole hand and just gently press and hold. I'm only doing this to the left side of my face for the comparison video, but mostly I would just take it down my eyes, on the side of my nose, towards the bridge, and then I would just proceed to take it down. And it can keep going and going and going and going and going if you let it. I'm not even kidding. La Mer just seems to go on forever. And I, it's, oh, it's like one of my, oh, I just love it. Mm, I love it. Okay. So we're pressing this in. And the excess, I always just, I, you don't waste La Mer. You don't waste any luxury skincare product. But for me, because I value La Mer so much, I just don't waste any of it. So now we're gonna go in to the right side of my face and I am gonna show you La Prairie. This is their night cream to be used only at night. It has a very different texture so I could show you here how it looks on the back of my hands. 
very, very easy to move across, very hydrating and a very refreshing product. It almost feels gel-like. It definitely just feels very comfortable and effortless on top of your skin. And honestly, I could see a lot of people really liking this. I truly enjoy this product like a lot. Like I, I've used it. I love it. I'm going to miss it. I love the way my skin looks in the morning after I sleep in it. I'm very fragranced. Like, like La Mer has like a very soothing, calm smell that doesn't see, it's like almost powdery and it doesn't, it doesn't overwhelm me and overbear me, but the La Prairie one definitely has strong, strong fragrances in all the La Prairie products. I have never had a situation where the fragrance irritated my skin, however, which I think is kind of amazing for La Prairie because at first when you smell it, you're like, oh my God, like, like my skin's gonna have a breakdown. But when you use this product, it just doesn't do that. Like in my experience, this is such a good quality product and it just really, really changed my skin for the better and actually cleared up a lot of irritation. So I was very impressed with this product and I'm definitely willing uh, and wanting to try more La Prairie products. So we're, I'm gonna take this off the back of my hand. Again, you get a lot out of cost per wear. You do get a long time out of this product. However, I do have to say, I think you still get a longer time out of the La Mer creams just because of just because of the way they apply it just a little goes such a long way I've had the La Prairie jar way less than I've had a one ounce jar of La Mer and this is a 1.7 ounce yeah this is 1.7 ounces just an FYI you just have a lot more time with La Mer products so uh, I just sweep this across my face. You guys can see super, super easy to apply. Nothing strenuous, nothing annoying about the application process. For people, there's a lot of people I find that are just like, they openly admit it and it's totally normal, totally fine. There are, people just don't want to take the extra steps. They're like, no, like I just, I'm lazy with my skincare and I, I just want and done. I want to be over with it. And it's like, okay, so you know, if you if if you're a little more lazy with your skincare routines and you just want to get it over with as fast as possible, that's fine. It's a thought that counts. But um, just that extra step with La Mer may be a little time consuming. You don't need to use that method when applying La Prairie products. Just FYI. So this product feels like very refreshing on my skin and very moisturizing and on my skin. Uh, it definitely ha gives you a very different experience than La Mer. La Mer gives you this like La Mer glow that is like stunning. It also makes my skin very soft and hydrated where the La Prairie feels even thicker, believe it or not, in some odd way. It's just a very different texture. Um, both I feel like are equal to the hydration scale, like on the hydration scale. They both do a fantastic job at giving me the most beautiful, well-balanced texture when I wake up in the mornings after using these. Like my skin is most flawless when using one of these products. Even applying them under makeup, like waking up and then applying makeup over them, I always say that's such a good indicator on how well a product moisturizes your skin because if your skin is well balanced, well moisturized with very little texture, your makeup applies like a dream. That's why so many people, like when they go get microderms or chemical peels, they'll always, or like um, like a hydrofacial, they'll always say my, my makeup applies like a dream after it. It applies like a dream after it because everything's well moisturized, you've taken all of this texture off your face, and of course you get a facial with it in a way, so your, your makeup applies like a dream. So I always just cut out like the microderms and the chemical peels and I just invest more into luxury moisturizers and I honestly, I get the same experience the next morning. So that's why I always like to say I like to invest more into my moisturizers and serums and my actual skincare than I do facials because I believe if using these correctly and finding the right brands that work for you, you're gonna really need facials less and less and less. That's just in my experience. So all in all, when it comes to which product I would prefer, although I love, 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 love this La Prairie product, I think it's great and I definitely recommend you purchase it. I still love, of course, you guys know, the original Creme de la Mer more. Just because you could use it day and night, I think it suits my skin, I think it hydrates it in such a beautiful, beautiful way. I always have 
have the best results when it comes to La Mer. I love to layer all my La Mer products. La Prairie, when I complete this, I'm not going to want to repurchase it, even though I'm going to miss it when it does go out of stock, because I could see myself in a year from now wanting this product again. Like, that's how much I really, really love this. Where a creme de la mer, a creme de la mer is a product that I always just want on hand 24-7. Like, I'm always going to need an original creme de la mer in my skincare mini fridge, ready to go whenever I need it because of just how soothing and healing it is. And I just love the miracle broth like I just really do I just think the miracle broth changes my skin for the better if you guys have irritated skin or you have sensitive skin definitely try the La Mer first La Mer is known for its healing and calming properties so definitely go with La Mer first however don't count La Prairie out however I have heard from a lot of other people though that La Prairie does irritate their skin these are my final thoughts you guys I hope you found this video helpful to you I hope you enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed it if you haven't done so again subscribe to my channel share my videos with your friends let's get the word out that this channel is dedicated to luxury skincare and we need to shout it from the rooftops and we have no shame about it if you're not into luxury skincare that's fine still watch my my videos though so you can at least get the experience without having to purchase the products anyway everybody follow me on instagram and until next time i love you stay hydrated stay moisturized stay glowing bye